Hi, my name is Kimbo, and welcome to Bakugan. We've got a package here. So, let's see what we got. It says Priority Mail on it. I uh, got a Reptar it, if I can. Maybe there's some tape on it. Okay, yeah, it looks like there's a bit of tape there, but I'm still going to Reptar it. Because I feel like it. Yeah, let's go. Boom. All right, and we got another package <laughs> in this plastic wrap. Okay, so, let's see what we got in here. If I can get it. Boom. Boom. And inside we've got what? Got this. Oh my god, dude. Yo, hype. Check it out, man. We've got this. This absolutely epic looking Bakugan. Armored Alliance. Diamond Pegatrix X Gorine Ultra starter pack man so seems like this is going to be the very last uh diamond three pack for armored alliance man managed to find it it is none other than pegatrix x goreen ultra and look how cool it looks with all the clear it already was a really sick ball form but that extra clear with the white and the gold dude it looks really really sick it looks so so sick and then we've got Diamond Hellcore X Ramparian in here. Which, yo, check out that blue, the metallic blue and the black with the clear. Oh my gosh, that looks amazing. And Diamond Maxotar X Zentar with this, man. Look at the artwork for all of them. So wild. Yo, Pegatrix Gorian looks so sick in Diamond. Wow, they all look so, so amazing, man. And one of them has a helix with it, so that's that's big. But let's check out the back, man. Pegatrix X Gorine Ultra Challenge of Three to close it. Then Diamond uh, Maxotar X Zentar, Diamond Halcor X Ramparian, man. I'm shook. This is so so wild, dude. So the Ultra the Bakugan, Chorus ability cards, character cards, gate card instruction sheet, all that good stuff uh, within this. So yeah, man. Without further ado, let's get into it. I can get it open. See, I'm gonna try not to reptar it like crazy. I already like ripped the art in half. My bad. <laughs> My B, bro. Alright. Boom. And uh, see if I can get it out of there. Just a three pack, uh, you know, packaging and such. Getting them actually out. A little bit of a challenge. Nothing like too, too wild. Alright. There we go. Pretty sure this is Alcor Ramparian. Max Otar, Zentar. And then Pegatrix Goreen. There we go, man. Oh my gosh, all that clear. It looks it looks phenomenal. They all look so, so phenomenal. Alright, so since this is possibly like uh the last wave, basically hinting at it, um I'll check out the sheet and just see if they added anything else with it. Uh if there is a sheet. If not, then you know, so be it. It's all good. Uh there might not be, it might just be like the rules sheet. Maybe. Yeah, okay, it is just a rule sheet. It's not the actual uh, big time sheet with it. So, you know, I mean, it's all good. No big thing. Okay. So, oh, wait, never mind. Never mind. We got it right here. <laughs> all right, so let's see. Um. All right, so, yeah, Ramparian. So, uh, Diamond Ramparian, uh, for sure. Uh, let's see. Drago, Enoch, Hydrus, Pegatrix, Cyrus, Gilatoid, Treteris, Halcor, Serpentis, Hydrus, Trinel, Pegatrix, Gorean, Trox, Nobilius, Drago, Auxilator, Pharaoh, Gilator, Sabra, Pyravian, which we haven't seen one in Ventus yet. It's probably coming in this last wave. I wouldn't be surprised if it's in, in like, one of the three packs. Ryurazu, Maxodon, Barbetra, Hydrus, Batrix, Halcor, Ramparian, Hydronoid, Krakalios, Nilius, Enoch, which you gotta see big time. Probably gonna include it with this last, uh, Wave big time. Pegatrix, Gilator, Drago, Treteris, Chalk, Cyrus, Garganoid, Webum. Maybe you got to see it in a few more uh, factions. Uh, Maxitar, Zentar, one we got to see big time. Cyndia, Scorpio, same thing. Klopdor, Polyon, same thing. Uh, Fangzor, Mantanoid, seen it quite a bit. And Pegatrix, X Goreen as a core, man. So, yeah, we definitely got to um, see that. Maybe that's the only one they're putting out. Um, time will tell. But, yeah, dude, now let's get into it. So let's see. We'll get into the uh, the gate card first. All right. So gotta get uh, Al Corampari and it rolled all the way over there. Okay. So we got the gate card here. Check it out. Drago Treteris. 
Uh, Ventus Heos, of course, 400, 100, 500, 300, 0, and 200. So Ventus getting the biggest boost with this. Pyrus getting a pretty good one. Same with Heos. But yeah, dude, there's the gate card. And now we got the cores for the pro version, of course. So the Helix plus 2, Fusion Bakugan get plus 500. Okay, pretty nice Fusion core. Uh, Fusion Bakugan plus 5 with that fist. Flame fist here. Plus three and Fusion Bakugan getting plus four. Um, then we got plus two Fusion Bakugan getting another plus two with that fist. A lot of regular fists in here. Um, plus two, another uh, Fusion Bakugan plus two. Um, and then Chaos and Ventus getting plus 400 with that. So, yeah, man. Okay. Overall, some pretty good cores with this. Okay. So now let's get into it, dude. So we'll get into the cores uh, first. Might as well. All right. So. Howcore Ramparian. Gotta check this one out. All right. Diamond Howcore X Ramparian looks so sick. Let's see. Is it strong enough to pick up two? Um, yo, it, it tries. It tries for sure. If you're careful with it, maybe you can get two, but it definitely tries for that second one. But check it out, dude. All three of the heads and such. And then I see um Ramparian's body and Howcore's heads. Just so wild. All the clear. Got the sky blue. Uh, for the teeth and the mouths, so sick. Uh, the purple, the green, all the clear, of course. Um, the black and the blue, the metallic blue looks so sick. The black tail, absolutely dig it, man. It looks so, so great. Aquas and Darkest. So let's see, uh, where is that B power at? I know it's got to be hiding somewhere. They probably got it in gold. Um, but yeah, oh, there it is. B power 500. Okay, so decent right out of the gate. All right, then next up, we've got Maxotar X Zentar. Here we go. Hey, got it. It did a face plant, but it's all good. Let's see. Can it pick up two? It can, man. You saw it right there. It can, if you're careful with it, uh, pick up two cores. So, yeah, definitely a little tricky for it. But if it lands like on the side, probably, yeah, it picks up two uh, pretty easily. So, yeah, dude, but check it out. Got the horns of Maxotar right there. All the green, that lime green looks so sick. Also for the jaw. The face is just completely clear, man. Then, uh, you know, got the chest plate right there. Got the yellow, the green looking so, so awesome. This lime green right there. All the clear for the legs. The legs of Zentar, absolutely awesome, man. And the white paint on the top it looks so so cool man it's such an amazing looking diamond like holy crap so so sick let's see where is that b power there it is b power 300 okay so hopefully it has the helix i mean if it has the helix with it it'll be up to like 900 which isn't too too bad but yeah it might not break a thousand but you know still nothing too terrible and last but not least we've got diamond Pegatrix X Goreen Ultra, man. Check it out. All the clear. It looks amazing. Got the gold for the horn and on the sides of the face. Got the sky blue for the legs. Got a bit of the white right there um, for the front, for like the shoulders and such. And then we got all the white paint for the wings along with the gold. Looks so, so good, man. And then you can see the eye of Goreen right there uh, with that sky blue. All the white right there. Just looks absolutely amazing as a diamond, dude. You already know Fang Shaman's going to see this and be like, yo, that looks pretty sick. But B power 700, pretty good right out of the gate, especially if it has the helix, you know. But yeah, man, I mean, time will tell. And even if it has the fist, you know, it's got access to Holy Flame, so that'll be really, really nice. All right, man. So now let's get into uh, the cards. So I guess we'll get into um, uh, the Evos first. So we got Diamond, Maxotar, Exentar. I don't know if all of them got, like, you know, all the diamonds get, like, an Evo like this, like, for the fusions. But, you know, time will tell. Especially when we get, like, uh, Shields of Astroia, Fusion Force, those waves of the of the TCG, you know. But, yeah. Maxotar, Exentar, Diamond. Six cost, 1,515. It's a beefy boy, you know. Really, really powerful. Um, then we got Diamond Howcore X Ramparian. Eight cost for it, but 1,808. Also a pretty beefy boy, uh, but eight cost. Of course, five for the Frost Strike and the Shadow Strike also. That artwork looks so sick, man. And then, yo, Pegatrix X Goreen 
ultra 1210 if it lands on a flame fist dude it gets plus 700 six costs for that yeah i mean 1900 plus that like 2150 and 13 it's getting up to so that's pretty nice honestly you know six cost that is sick diamond package tricks x gorine ultra looking so cool and then you see sv shields of Astroya. so that's probably where we'll get like a decent amount of like evos and such maybe with shields of Astroya. Uh, but yeah, man, then we got Maxitar and Zentar here, 303. The interesting thing about it is that if it lands on a magic shield, it gets the fusion, but it's also got a shield and a helix with it. But if it lands on a magic shield, it gets the fusion. That's really, really interesting. It'll make it where you have to really switch up what Bakugan you have in the deck with it, because it'll bring out... I love that, though, because some Bakugan bring out the potential of other Bakugan when they're paired together, and Maxitar... And Zentar definitely shows that. But lands on a magic shield that gets the fusion. So that's really sick. Uh, 303. Flip it over. 606. But I mean, lands on the magic shield. You're talking like what? A uh, regular one would be 1250 and 6. But you land on uh, the magic shield with the 800. 1406. And that's pretty nice, honestly. You can get that right away with the right setup. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, Maxitar. X Zentar. Looks so good, man. Ventus Chaos. Definitely love the, the full art for this. I really hope that they're going to do that for the elites. And then we got Howl Core uh, and Ramparian. Double Fist with it, 505. So, I mean, it's getting up to, like, what, 650 and, uh, like, 8 max. Like, 650 and 8. Well, 608 or 650 and 7. So... Yeah, not too, too wild, but paired with Chaos or something, you know, could be pretty good. Uh, then Howlcore X Ramparian, 1,406. So, I mean, it's like six costs for the fusion, but, you know, 1,406, not too, too bad. Um, but it does look so, so sick. I love the full art style, man. It just looks so amazing. And then last but not least, Pegatrix and Goreen Ultra, 703. Uh, Flame Fist and Regular Fist, so yeah, 950 and 6 it's getting up to. Almost breaking a thousand they are, uh, so that's pretty cool. But four costs for the fusion, then going up to nine hundred and five. So, yeah, man. I mean, what that would be like eleven fifty and eight. So, yeah, but also getting in that uh, you know, that Evo, that Diamond Evo, that's really big, you know. So maybe some of them will get like Diamond Evos or such. That'll help them out. But uh, yeah, dude. Overall, just a really, really awesome pack. So, I gotta close up Pegatrix Goreen and show off that opening action. So, of course, uh, da 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 da, head, shoulders, knees, and toes. If I can get them. All right, here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. And oh, I'm getting there. Kind of getting there. Okay, I gotta get the head. And there it is, man. Check it out. Diamond. Pegatrix X Gorine Ultra. It looks so sick. The gold, the clear, all the white. Absolutely amazing, man. So now, that opening action for it, of course. Alright, here we go. 3, 2, 1, Bakugan. Bro! Hey, what? <laughs> Yo, okay, so that tail part is the only thing that opened. Uh, let's see. Let's even get it. Probably got like a tight mold with it. Roll back. And hey. <laughs> Wow. All right. It just has the tail really opening right now. So maybe it's like not closed the exact right way. So, you know, I mean, I'll, uh, I'll fix it. Of course. Let's see. Yeah. It's just a tail that's coming out right now. Uh, I'll get it. I'll get it. All right. Let's try it again, man. Let's see. It definitely seems like it has a pretty, uh, tight mold, which not even upset. So in case you drop it, it might not open all the way, but yeah, let's see. And hey, there we go. Okay. <laughs> it popped open that time. It just shot off camera. Um, all good, man. But there it is, dude. Diamond Pegatrix X Goreen Ultra. Looks so good, man. Absolutely love it, man. Just looks so, so awesome as a diamond. But yeah, guys. Anyways, that is it for this review on this absolutely amazing Bakugan Armored Alliance Diamond Pegatrix X Goreen Ultra 3-pack. 
Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to slice the ever-loving crap out of that like button down below. Let me know how I did. If you're new to my channel, definitely be sure to subscribe for some epic, epic content because I upload daily. And if you haven't already, be sure to ring that bell by my channel name to be notified whenever I upload a video. They all look so, so amazing, dude. They're all just so cool. Totally honored to have them in my collection. But yeah, man. Anyways, till next time, it is your boy Kimbo signing off. See you guys later. Thanks so much for watching. Until then, stay awesome and Bakugan Brawl. I'm up out of here.